we will dominate every aspect of this challenge. There's that arcade machine the kids always play. That's classified. Classified? To whom? Looks more like you're just hanging around by a hole in the wall. Absolutely not. We're in the midst of a covert training operation, trying to bring the private here up to speed in the ancient military art of fishing. Now that I think about it, the operation really isn't so covert. Would you care to observe? Sure. Beats anything else I got going. All right, private. It's time to prove yourself in the field. Move your pole left and right. Once you're ready to drop that lure, hold down the action button, and when you want to reel the fish in, just release the action button. Look up and down to control how far you throw the lure. Simple, right? Well, let's see you catch some fish. Not give up, son. Not quick enough, son. The fish will grab the bait right off the hook. It pre You've caught the wrong color fish. This is not acceptable. Start over immediately. Ten, two, three, four. Keep fishing, so. Technique, son. Now let's see you land that green garami fish. Those penguins are psychotic. Not give up, son. You got some chops as a fisherman, son. But war sometimes requires creativity. Snare a stuffed lion decoy. May come in handy later. Find me some sunglasses. Now get me a bucket, soldier. Steadfast, that was some first class fishing. You've completed your training. Those penguins are cooking something up. Hmm. Wonder if Melman's cooled off enough to talk. Hey, Marty, I forgot to wish you happy birthday earlier. Sometimes I get wrapped up in my own problems. My basic hygienic needs are going unmet. Say what? I don't do medical speak. 
My biohazard disinfectant team is late, again. You just can't get good help. And they're unionized, so just try to complain. Did you ever think about cleaning the cage yourself? I don't even think you have a biohazard disinfectant team. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. But I guess I could try to clean things up around here. I'm not afraid of a little dirt. Melman, press your attack button to spin that garbage out of your cage. Unless you like those germs. I don't do germs. you again, Melman. Don't caught me on that, though. I'm more concerned with how the chaos affected my immune system. I'm sure it will recover. It's your mental state that you should be more worried about. The zoo is driving us crazy. I just have to get out to the wild. Thanks, Melman. Time to get back to my place and eat some of that fine Kentucky bluegrass for lunch and dinner and dessert. I've heard some rumors about your supposed disposition to the confines of your brick-laden cell. One more time? Different? You want out? Uh, yeah, I do. Welcome aboard the Freedom Express, my monochromatic friend. I'm here to spring you. All you gotta do is stay close to me at all times, and do not panic. I just have one question. If we're trying to sneak out of here without the guards knowing, why are you yelling? That is an excellent question, Stripes. Let me get back to you on that. Here's the situation. The entire zoo is buttoned up tight by a series of locked gates. Each key opens the gate with the matching animal icon. Use the keys at the terminals to open the gate. The first gate we need to open is Gate Ostrich. The Zone Ostrich key is located in the janitor's shed, but the only way in there is a small crawl space. You don't know how to crawl yet, but we can fix that. Three of our operatives have smuggled in power cards. Each operative in sequence will give you their cards. Collect all three and you'll be able to crawl into that shed and get that key. Now follow me to Darnell, our first operative. Hey. Is it time for me to do my special trick? Darnell here has been storing a power card safely in his belly for the last several days. Now the plan is to have him spit it out. You'll need it and two more to gain your next ability. Uh, you sure he's gonna spit it out of his mouth, right? Marty, we better hope so. Okay, here goes. Good work. Now get the remaining power cards from the other two operatives. Take that! Um, hey, Nick. Skipper says you might have a little something for me. <laughs> He's right! <laughs> I got what you need. Good 
chick. Careful, Stripe. Where are you going, horse face?